Hey there, fellow garden enthusiasts. Welcome back to Growing with Glenna, where we explore all things green and sustainable. Today, I've got a fantastic project for you. Repurposing old cattle panels and T-posts into beautiful trellises and arbors for your garden for next to nothing. So, let me walk you through what I did. I had these old cattle panels lying around, you know, the ones that are 16 feet long and 50 inches high. And I thought, why not turn them into something useful for my garden? I wanted a double trellis to go in front of my windows, providing shade and a perfect spot for my climbing plants and indeterminate tomatoes. First things first, I gathered my materials, two cattle panels and six T-posts. Here's a rough blueprint of the double trellises outside my windows. Hopefully you can get some ideas for how you want to space yours. I put the bottom of my cattle panels about 18 inches off the ground so that I would have more height over my windows. The next step needs a little bit of teamwork. Get you some gloves, fold those cattle panels in half, and be sure to use a tie down to keep them from popping back open unexpectedly. Next, place one cattle panel arch side up in the middle of the T-post. I made sure to leave those 18 inches from the ground for each side. Then secure them tightly with strong wire. I repurposed some old baling wire for this step. And let me tell you, a good pair of gloves really comes in handy here, along with a nice set of pliers. Once the first panel is secure, repeat the process with the second panel. You can use sturdy zip ties to join the middle panels together on each side of the T-post. And there you got it a sturdy set of double trellises. As a really nice side note, I hung a hummingbird feeder from one of my trellises and this leaves a place for the hummingbirds to rest. They love sitting on the trellis, then going and getting some nectar, then going back to the trellis. You will be able to study hummingbirds in a way you never have before. If you're feeling ambitious like I did, you can extend this type of project into a beautiful arbor walkway. Just repeat the process with two more panels and eight T-posts. This not only provides a stunning feature for your garden, but also creates the perfect environment for climbers like Indian Python snake beans and Trumpachino squash. Growing vertically is a game changer for any gardener. It maximizes space and encourages healthier plant growth. And the best part? Repurposing these panels and T-posts costs next to nothing. Just a bit of time and effort. Look how those squash, the beans, the loofahs, and all those plants with tendrils are flourishing. It's a sustainable garden at its finest, folks. Helping to green out our planet and provide fresh, homegrown food for your table. Well, that's all for today, folks. I hope you enjoyed this DIY garden project as much as I did. If you like this repurposing project, then give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to Growing with Glenna, where we are always working on tips and techniques to grow your own food with passion and simplicity. Thanks for watching.